All right, guys, today I'm excited to share with you a beard product that is brand new to the market. I mean, it just hit recently. It's called Wake Up Call Beard Jelly by Aerolens Natural Goods. This is a company out of Maryland. I happened to come across this product just by scrolling through Instagram and I had hit a couple of, of uh, posts and the, the founder of Aerolens, Zach Dolan, reached out to me. He DM'd me. I didn't reach out to him. He reached out to me and asked me if he could send me a bottle of his Wake Up Call Beard Jelly. And um, he said he'd like to see what I thought of it and possibly give him a review. I said, sure, why not? So I am not an affiliate with them. I am not getting paid any money uh, through them. But I did receive their beard jelly for free. And I had the opportunity and the pleasure of trying this for a week straight. This is the only thing I've been using for one week. And I have to say, it's pretty amazing. It's, let me tell you about it. Let me tell you about this. Now, I am familiar with beard jelly. Okay, I'm very familiar with it. As far as I know, there's only one other company that makes beard jelly. And I really like it a lot. A lot of guys don't know what it is. It's kind of it's a product that's kind of a blend between oil and beard balm. So you kind of have two in one. That's the that's the best likeness I can give of it. And some people like that kind of thing. Some people don't, and I get it. Everybody has their preference. But I have a lot of experience with beard jelly, so I have something to compare this with. And why I was so eager to give this a shot was because. I thought it was about time someone else came up with their own beard jelly. And I thought that I, because I think it's just a really cool idea. So it got sent to me. I opened it up in the box. And uh, right away, as, as soon as you smell this, as soon as you open it up, oh, that smells so good. This on, on the bottle, it says original spice. Now, what it also says is it's naturally caffeinated. Naturally caffeinated. Let me put my reading glasses on and tell you what, it sell, what else it says in the bottle. High viscosity beard oil with green coffee and peppermint oils. So you can just imagine, probably imagine, the kind of scent uh, that uh, approaches your, your nose. So on the back of the bottle it says, Wake up your beard enriched with virgin cold pressed green coffee oil. This high viscosity formula packs a natural caffeine boost for a thicker, and healthier looking beard. So I have never tried any products with caffeine in it, although I've heard about such products and the benefits of them. I never knew what to think. I didn't have an opinion. So, you know, I really, in that sense, I have nothing to compare it to. But I think the idea of caffeine in a product is kind of cool. And I don't really have a lot to remark on about that because, I mean, I don't really know if it does what it says it does or not, but I can tell you what it reports. So this is really cool. Now, here's the other ingredients that this has in it, and I'll tell you how it performed in my beard. I'll show you how to apply it. So he gives you a paper when he sends this product to you. He sends you this paper with the ingredients printed out on it. And here's what the ingredients are. Virgin cold pressed green coffee oil, which I've mentioned already, a gentle and nutrient packed alternative to synthetic caffeine for a hardier beard growth. It boasts high levels of chlorogenic acid and other potent antioxidants. Okay, sounds good. Peppermint oil, stimulates and smooths the skin and beard, promoting thicker and healthier hair. I love any beard product with peppermint in it. I just love that scent. Um, and I have, I've heard people extol the virtues of peppermint oil many times. And so I'm all in. Uh, enriched with beeswax forms a subtle nutrient rich barrier, sealing in caffeine and other key ingredients. So what I like about beard jelly is it's not, it's not so heavy on the beard balm that it leaves your beard feeling stiff, which I'll have to talk more about in just a minute. And so while it does have beeswax in it, it's just not overloaded with it. Sweet almond oil, apricot kernel oil, rice brain oil, and sunflower oil. Delivers a broad spectrum of essential vitamins and fatty acids for supreme silkiness. 
and cetyl alcohol, a natural emollient derived from coconut oil, enhancing the formula's conditioning capabilities without drying the skin. So cetyl alcohol is different than like ethyl alcohol. You might have seen that ingredient on, on any given product. Ethyl alcohol will actually dry out your skin and your beard and pull moisture away, where cetyl alcohol actually helps smooth the beard and moisturize it. So that's a very important component in all of this. So how did it perform? Well, I'll tell you, first of all, here's how you apply it. When you, when you first get it, before you put it on, you want to shake it up really well because it does, you know, beard jelly just, have, just has a tendency to kind of separate. Actually, any product that you put in your beard, you probably ought to shake up, even regular beard oil. But you shake it up, pop the cap, and you only want to put a pea size amount of beard jelly in your palm. Now, uh, it's easy to put too much. And with the other beard jelly that I had mentioned, if you put too much in, you notice it right away and it can be unpleasant. I did not experience that with this. This has a different, different texture altogether. So you want to put a pea size amount in your palm. You could, you could rub your hands together to warm them up if you wanted to, to help make it, make things easier to apply. But there you go. Just a pea size amount. I put in four small drops. Of course, my, my beard is on the bigger side. So let me put just a little bit more because I just kind of know <laughs> how much my beard requires. Different size beards require different amounts of products. So anyway, that's what I have right there. I rub it around really good. Get it between the fingers. Oh, that peppermint and that coffee blended together smells so good. So. I'm going to go up. You usually want to apply this to a damp beard. My beard is not damp, but, um, and this, I have to say, it doesn't really make a whole lot of difference. This stuff is still really good regardless of when you put it in, but ideally you want to put it in a damp beard. I'm going to go up and, and apply it just like you would oil right directly to the skin and then out. Then with the product between my fingers, I can run it, rake it to the beard, going out from the skin, and then back down. And one of the, oh, several, there's several things I want to say about this product that I really like a lot. This, all week long, has given my beard such a, such a such a soft texture. I can't believe how well this softens my beard up, and I am not joking. I'm I'm not joking. I'm not getting like I said. I'm not getting paid to say anything. I'm not an affiliate, so I don't I don't have a dog in the fight. I'm just telling you what I honestly think. This leaves my beard feeling so incredibly soft, and that's that's vitally important to me. I do not like walking around with a beard that feels dry and stiff. Um, I'd like it to be manageable, but soft, okay? So if I have anything remaining in my hands, I just rub it into any exposed skin I might have. And then I'll take my wide tooth comb and comb through it. Maybe rake up a little bit. to really distribute it even better than I did with my fingers. Lay it back down. It smells so, so good. Yeah. So anyway, here's what I like about this product. First of all, it leaves your beard soft, like I said. Second of all, this has provided a shine to my beard that is almost unequaled with just about anything else I have. I mean, sometimes you sometimes you have to you know, apply oil several times to get a really good shine to a beard, but my beard literally shimmers. I, I actually love that. It looks clean, it smells clean, it feels very, very soft. And that's why I do recommend this product to you quite a bit. 
I have enjoyed it. I do recommend. Now this is, now mind you, I have not used anything else in addition to this. I have put this in a clean beard, but I have not used anything else in addition to, I have not put oil or balm before or after. It's solely just this wake up call beard jelly. Naturally caffeinated wake up call beard jelly. Oh, so good, original spice. I will say, Aralan's Goods, um, this is the only product that I can tell they have. I'm very excited to see what evolves from here. The, the natural course of things seems to dictate that they would branch out into washes and conditioners and other, other things and maybe other scents, but I don't know. I haven't had that discussion with, with Zach, but I am looking forward to whatever else they might produce. And when they do so, as soon as I get wind of it, I will let you know. If he lets me know, that is. So I absolutely love Wake Up Call Beard Jelly. I'll put a link down below. I think it's just arrowlandsgoods.com. Um, it's $22 a bottle. It's 3.1 ounces. That's a pretty, that's a pretty generous amount. So get your own today. You won't be disappointed, I can assure you. This is, I just love what it does for my beard. Really, really satisfying. All right, guys, I hope you've enjoyed that. I hope it's meant something to you. If you get this for yourself, let me know what your thoughts are. And if you have a way of doing so, let Zach know that I sent you. And to Zach, I wanna say thank you for giving me the opportunity to try this out for myself. All right, guys, have a great day. I'll see you in the next one.